This is important to understand that at times the therapy is not only being given in individual setting, but it is being given to a group. While talking about group therapy, psychologists describe at onset of the roles and responsibilities of all parties and limits to confidentiality. Like in the case of group therapy, the psychologist would not be concerned only with the stake of one individual, but rather to all the group members. Because uske liye ek individual bhi utna hi important hai jitna us group ka har ek member hai. So like whenever we are going to give the group therapy, we have to see the group dynamics as well. We have to see in which setting we are providing the therapy to the group. Aur us group ke har individuals ke stakes utne hi important honge jitne individual therapy mein ek single individual ke hote hain. So we just can't undermine the importance of group therapy over individual therapy. Rather, in some cases, the group therapy is more influential than individual therapy. Providing therapy to those served by others. Psychologists carefully consider treatment issues and the potential client's welfare to minimize the risk of confusion and conflict. Sometimes if the patient is uh, already under treatment for, by another psychologist, or kisi reason say uski relocation ki vaja se uski health issue ya uski kisi uh, or problem ki vaja se in case of death maybe usko hume shuffle karna padta hai client ko aur usse ek naye group therapy mein hum part de rahe hain jiske baki ke members already waha par uh, uh, settle ho chuke hain aur ek naya member usme aa gaya to humne ye dekhna hai ki usko koi conflicting situation to nahi face karni padi just because becoming a new member to that ya usko koi uncomfortable situation to nahi feel ho rahi koi role conflict to nahi aa raha ya uski jo prior learning experiences hain wo usko is learning experience ke sath koi hurdle to nahi kar rahe so we need to see ke is cheez ko bhi hum review kare ke agar hum group therapy mein kisi aur ke client ko include kar rahe hain to uska preview kya ho sakta hai then when we talk about the intimate relationship we need to be very careful while we are looking into group therapy for instance when we are looking that the current clients are in process with us we need to be very careful that not any kind of uh, intimate relation may be developed between the psychologist and the client because while doing the therapy this would be highly unethical to develop any kind of intimate relationship with the current client Sexual intimacy is with relatives of current therapy client is equally highly unethical as far as the client themselves selves are concerned or the clients uh, who are their past clients or their relatives this is equally unethical for all of them so psychologists do not engage in any kind of intimate relationship with the close relatives guardians and significant others of current clients then intimate relation with former therapy client is also uh, not allowed to be practiced uh, as such we can say that at least 2 years after the discontinuation of uh, or cessation or termination of therapy and considering other important factors such as the nature and duration of treatment the current mental uh, state of the client and impact of the decision on clients we have seen different movies uh, which are being based on uh, this very principle jisme ye cheez dikhai jati hai ki therapeutic intervention chuke ek long time uh, relationship hota hai aur isme at times personal infatuations or relationship develop hone ke chances hote hain to wahan par is cheez ko carefully kaise tackle kiya ja sakta hai and uh, there are the different movies which address this issue and they provide the technical review over it that how can uh, a therapist avoid getting himself into certain such conflicting situations then interruption of therapy when entering into employment or contractual relationship psychologists make reasonable efforts to provide for a appropriate orderly resolution of responsibility for clients and patients and their care in event that employment on contractual relationships ends with paramount consideration given to the welfare of the client and patient so you know this is very very important ke jab humne ek therapy ko 
टर्मिनेट करना है उसकी सजेशन करनी है तो उसमें भी क्लाइंट के वेलफेयर को सामने रखते हुए की जाए एट टाइम्स वी अंडरस्टैंड दैट दिस केस में बी गोइंग टू गिव थेरेपी फॉर फिफ्टीन वीक्स लेकिन आपको ट्वेल्व वीक्स के बाद लगता है कि अब ज़रूरत नहीं है तो वहाँ पर आप क्लाइंट की वेलफेयर उसकी फ़ी को अपने जहन में रखते हुए उसकी सजेशन अर्ली भी कर सकते बट इन सर्टन सर्कमस्टांसिस जहाँ आपको लगता है कि यू नीड टू गो बियॉन्ड द फिफ्टीन सेशन एंड मे बी इट विल टेक ट्वेंटी एंड ट्वेंटी टू सेशन तो वहाँ पर वेलफेयर ऑफ द क्लाइंट ये है कि उसकी फ़ी बचाने की कोशिश ना की जाए बल्कि उसको प्रॉपर थेरेपी देने के लिए उस सेशन को मज़ीद कॉन्टीन्यू रखा जाए हाउ एवर द क्लाइंट मे बी टेकन इन एडवांस इन कॉन्फिडेंस कि हम ये डिसीजन उसकी वेलफेयर के लिए कर रहे हैं दैन टर्मिनेटिंग द थेरेपी प्रायर टू द टर्मिनेशन साइकोलॉजिस्ट प्रोवाइड काउंसलिंग टू द क्लाइंट्स एंड सजेस्ट ऑल्टरनेट सर्विस एज अप्रोप्रिएट टर्मिनेशन कैन बी टेक प्लेस इफ इट बिकम्स क्लियर दैट द क्लाइंट और द पेशेंट नो लॉन्गर नीड्स द सर्विस एंड इट इज़ नॉट लाइकली टू बी बेनिफिटेड लाइक हम एक थेरेप्यूटिक इंटरवेंशन में असेस करते हैं कि दैट स्पेसिफिक टेक्निक इन विच द थेरेपिस्ट इज एक्सपर्ट इज नॉट बेनिफिटिंग द क्लाइंट सो हम वहाँ पर सजेस्ट कर सकते हैं कि हम उसका कोई अप्रोप्रिएट रेफरल कर दें रादर देन कि हम उस क्लाइंट को देखते रहे और उसको उसका उस थेरेपी का कोई भी फ़ायदा ना हो एंड देन इफ द क्लाइंट और अ पर्सन विद होम क्लाइंट हैज रिलेशनशिप थ्रेट इन द साइकोलॉजिस्ट तो इन अदर वे राउंड इफ इट इज़ नॉट गोइंग टू बी इन द वेलफेयर ऑफ द साइकोलॉजिस्ट और ये रिलेशनशिप जो थेरेपी का है वो साइकोलॉजिस्ट को थ्रेटन कर रहा है बाई एनी मीन उसकी वेलफेयर को डिस्टर्ब कर रहा है ही हैज़ और शी हैज़ ऑल द लीगल राइट टू टर्मिनेट द थेरेपी एंड रेफर द क्लाइंट टू सम अदर पर्सन so basically the termination of therapy involves the welfare of either the client or either the welfare of the psychologist jo uski uh, comfort ko dekhte hue uski emotional uh, stability ko dekhte hue kiya jata hai this is important ki hum uh, ye decision jo hai wo appropriately le le soon after we uh, are going to diagnose ki ye therapy jo hai wo beneficial nahi hai for anyone of the persons who are included into that formal contract of counseling and therapy